So here's a shortened, eye funny version of Terrible Tim. Kid so terrible that no matter what his teacher told him to do, if she said, sit down, he stand up. Go forward, he go backwards. Sky is blue, he said was black. And so when she handed out the books to all the students, she was one short. So she figured I might as well give Terrible Tim, you know, one that had no writing in it because he's not going to do anything anyway. He don't ever listen. And in fact, you know, he never says please, thank you, or or um, yes. All he says is no. So just give him a book with no writing in it. So Tim went home that morning, laid in bed, and said, what did I do to deserve such a fate? And then he remembered all the bad things he did, kicking the dog, running away from the teacher, and lying on students. So the next day, teacher walks into class. Hello, teacher. Hello, Tim. Then she gets to her desk. Hello, Tim. I can't believe it. He spoke. Not only that, he said, yes, thank you, and please. So he went from worst to first. She called 1-800-GET-BOOK. She couldn't have him with a book with no writing in it. So she ordered a book, and that evening, he had a book that had writing in it. So, being five years old, could he color within the lines? Nope. So guess what the teacher did for him? That's right. She made sure she colored for him. Now, I pack up my things, but I'm crazy like a fox because I leave the classroom, and the kids have to tell me, hey, you forgot your book. But before they tell me, they're a little mischievous too. They checked all throughout the book to try to see how I did it. But no matter what they do, they can't see how I did it.